Hi, it's Ellen from Living Clean and Dirty, and I am consumed with how our water is. Not taste-wise, because I can't tell the difference, although I have a kid that does. Um, she totally can tell the difference between waters, but I am consumed with what's in our water. So much so that I have a whole house water. You hear that? That's why we're concerned about the water. That's why I'm concerned about the water, exactly, because we drink it all day long. Um, we're concerned with what's in it from the source, so I have a whole home water filtration unit because your largest organ is your skin. Maybe your largest organ. And, um, and when it heats up in the shower, it opens up the pores and whatever's in your water gets into your body that way. So I have a whole house, horse house water filtration. Whole it's, horse. It's as big as a horse downstairs in my basement. It, and that's, that's accurate. Yeah, um, I'm not kidding. Then I have one of these. This is a hot cold that um, also has underneath it another water filter. And this is what I then use for my cold water that I put into one of these pitchers, which guess what it has? That's right, a filter. So this all came about because every year my district, my water district would release a study and I never understood it. I tried, I opened it up, I looked at everything, the multitude of pages, I did not understand a word of it. So um, this year I called up the water company and I said, is there a way that I can independently test my water? Not that I don't trust you guys, but I really can't read your water report. And the guy on the phone was really nasty to me and he was like, we have the best water in the United States. Right there, I mean, I come on, in the whole United States, we have the best water, um, especially because I live in the state of New York that actually made the news for the most contaminated water. Um, their argument also was it was the most tested water, so that's why you knew what was in it. So I contacted the people, I, I got off the phone with the water company, they were of no help. Um, they said, don't be ridiculous, there's no reason to test it. So I found a independent company that will test my water and I'm finally getting to the bottom of what's actually in my water. And I have nothing against these water home, home, whole home water people that come in and give you a, a whole filtration. They offer to test your water for free and then they tell you which filtration system to buy. And I'm sure they're lovely people, but I really wanted somebody independent <laughs> not somebody um, who's looking to sell me something. That is my dog. I've taught her when she wants to go out to uh, ring a bell. So um, Safe um, Home Products gave me, um, thank you Safe Home, two different ones to choose from. This is a city water test. They have a well water test, but I don't have well water, I have city water, so that's why I like this because I'm gonna be able to open it right now it's super easy. You can test your water and see what's in it immediately. And that has um, 14 contaminants, different contaminants to test for. This is one that you do, that you put in a vial and you send it away. And this will tell me of, uh, I believe it's 18. I have to read. Some people got a little old here. Like 15, those. excuse me, 15 contaminants. Um, and it will also tell you uh, some other information and that will come back. So between these two, I'm gonna actually just finally find out what's in my water. We opened up the package and we laid everything out and there's multiple tests. There's a lot of instructions here that are really self-explanatory, really super easy. And I'm gonna show you one in real time. We're gonna take the one that says zinc. I'm gonna cut it along the line. Okay. And um, it says to put it in for three seconds. I'm gonna be really exact about this. I'm sure you don't have to be, but ready? And then you have to, 20 seconds. By the time I figure it out, it's, it won't matter. So what are we looking for? So I did zinc, three seconds, hold it 20 seconds. 
Okay, and it says interpret your test results. Okay, so that's in. for, yeah, this stuff is super specific. Here's zinc, right here. Okay. And this will tell you. How zinky you are. How zinky you are. I think it's been about 20 seconds. And I have to tell you. You're not very zinky. We are not zinky at all. That's fantastic. Okay, that's, that's good. That's all right, good. so then let's go through, uh, let's I'm test all the rest of them and we'll report back how our water did. Okay. So we finished doing all the tests and I have to say this was super easy to use. Um, what I also liked and I didn't get a chance to say it before was this is made in the USA and I love that. It says it right there too and I looked it up. Um, I try to find things um, that are manufactured here. So I'm very happy. That was one of the reasons why I chose this company. It also has the good housekeeping seal. It's not on here, but which remember I want an independent source. So I thought that was great. So it was pretty easy to do. We were able to do all of it together. Um, pretty simple. And they even give you this thing, this um, column here, so you can write your results on there. So you could take a look. So we're happy to let everyone know we are not pregnant. No, and by the way, this totally reminded me of taking pregnancy tests because we took pregnancy tests also before they made like a positive and negative. And it was like, is that a faint line? Is that a line, two is lines? Is it a blue line? Is it a thin line? Yeah, so that's what it's, it reminded me of doing, but we're past those days. Mm -hmm. So um, I can honestly say that that silly man at the water company is absolutely right. We have terrific water so we put in here now this is um we have alkaline uh they show also the ph and hard water and uh alkalinity so even though that seems like it's like a high number or something it's 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 we have high alkaline water is we, our is our ph fat um our, our it, ph is normal it's that's not, why it's not phat no it's not and i'm sorry and we have high alkaline water which i don't even know if that's a bad thing i don't really think it is but we had the zeros on most everything except here was 252. now it's interesting um what i really liked I like to be told exactly what to do. And I liked this showed you acceptable amount, moderate amount. It did take me quite some time because I couldn't read that. But these numbers in the red, that is where it's um, high amounts. That's your maximum. That's you your maximum. Higher than you that. know, our chloride actually is at the maximum. So we should look into that chloride. Um, I don't know where that went. No, I'm sorry. Sulfate. Oh, yeah. No, it's not. See, look, I'm, I'm all confused here. I'm sorry. Our numbers are good. I confuse the number. That's sulfate and that's chloride. So it's not the same thing. But they, um, those are the, the high markers. That took us a while to find. So I wish that was a little bit more clear. I like that moderate thing, acceptable amount. That was pretty easy. But once we figured it out, it made it pretty simple to see. There it is. I'm sorry. I knew it was something. There's my sulfate, 250. So we ought to look. I knew I was right. We ought to look a little bit into our sulfate. And that's the whole purpose of this is that I got instant results and I can see maybe where I'm deficient and what it all means. Now, the only thing I have to say is I really like how that was done with the numbers. We got to the phosphate here and, and, and we're somewhere pretty much like around here. There's nothing that tells me, I mean, I'm going to assume that that's too high, but there's nothing here that tells me what those levels mean. So we're going to have to look that up. So that's my only uh, complaint. They didn't have it here. The lead was super easy. That was our pregnancy test. It was like if one line is darker than the other. And that was great. Now we also did get, now there's a lot of kits. You can go on the website. There's a whole bunch of kits. Like I said, there's city water. There's one for just lead. There's, there's one for, um, all different types of that fits well, your needs. Well water. well water, right? And they you even go on the website and it it shows you could say it says what what test is good for me, so you can just sort of take a look. We also got this one. This one's the send away test, and it's I, I hate unboxing videos, but I'm gonna do it just this one time, okay? And it's super simple, easy. You fill it out, you put water in here, and you you keep this look you send it away for free. So it's pretty simple, pretty self-explanatory. That's what I liked. I, I, I get a little confused and overwhelmed with this. Super simple to do um, and really fun 
and you get your answers right here. Now we know that that man on that phone that made fun of me and said our water is good, that's a relative term, but I can tell you according to the 14 different contaminants in here, only one was um, showing that I was high. So it's a great way to test your water. And this is the other thing, it's coronavirus time, but it's a pandemic. But when the world starts opening up, what they said on the website that's really wonderful about this is if you travel and maybe you go someplace and you're not sure about the water and you're gonna be there for a little while and you wanna test the water, you take this with you. All you needed was a cup, we kept refilling it and, and a timer and you can instantly find out the water of where you are. So thanks for watching. Don't forget, subscribe to livingcleananddirty.com. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can make sure you can see all of our videos. Follow us on Instagram and Facebook.